Something heavy was dragged through here. Bodies. Dragonid musk. Fresh smelling. Must have settled in around here recently. Elf Guardian's prince. Led a group of barefoot prisoners through here. Elf Guardian's prince. Let a group of barefoot prisoners through here. Dug them up.
Who are you? Why do you sniff around here? Looking for work. Wait, wait. Two swords, eyes like slits. You are a witcher, is that so? Geralt of Rivia. I have not heard the name. But you will find work here, this I know. You happen to lose a unit recently? One is missing, yes. Did you find my notice? No. Found their bodies. Female wyvern killed them. They wandered into her hunting ground. A wyvern? Blue de pissed. Discovered something else. You didn't send those boys out to scout. That was a death squad. Let some Redanian prisoners out there. Executed them. War is like this. Who loses, dies. I don't want your coin. Oh, dead men buried in the woods. You are offended? They died honorably. Soldiers who let themselves be captured can have it. Here in Velen, hunger is our greatest foe. What was I to feed those prisoners, eh? Grass and mud? It was an act of mercy. You're a murderer, plain and simple. I am an Imperial Quartermaster, and we are done, Witcher. Soldiers. This is good. Our army refused to help. Yet help is what I need. So much so, I will ask a rock troll if required. Interesting train of thought, ma'am. Don't mean to dash your hopes, but not all soldiers come home from war. I know what war is. My husband fell at Brenner, but I had his body brought home to Nilfgaard. Buried there, I will do the same for my son, if I must. I require someone's help to find Herodoberth, or his body. Coin is no object. What's your son look like? Unlike others, easily distinguished. In all Nilfgaard's army, I do not think there was another with his mane. The color of fire. A red-haired Nilfgaardian? His father hailed from Magturga. Folk have like complexions there. My son inherited this trait and others from his father. May I count on your help? Do my best to help you. You will not regret it. There is nothing I would not do for Herodoberth. Remember this. I'll ask around, see if I can learn something. My servant strove to do the same. He drank with the soldiery in the mess but met no one from my son's company. It is as if it has ceased to exist. You must speak to the quartermaster. He is dismissive of me, but he will be more candid with you. I can feel it. A mother feels these things. Guess we'll see. How can I help? 
Ran into a woman, Nilfgaardian, who's looking for her son. I knew this one was stubborn. Did not know she would hire a witcher. Let's say a mother's tears moved me. What if all Nilfgaard's mothers came to find their sons? Can you imagine? Only met one and promised to help her. I'm to reveal our troop rules to some Nordic. Made me a coin pouch will untie your tongue. You seek to bribe an Imperial officer. Exactly. But just because I want to help an Imperial soldier's mother. Take the coin and tell me what you know. Red-haired whelp, Nazari Cavalry. A short time ago, he and several of his company sought to desert. I ordered them pursued. We caught some in the swamp not far from here. Others managed to flee. The men you caught, what happened to them? We hanged them. Wartime rules. But I cannot say the red-haired boy was among them. Hmm. You're an elf guardian officer. Expected you to be more conscientious. If I had reported that any had fled, I would have had to pursue them. I've neither the time nor the resources. So I wrote that all are dead. Unlikely any survived long in the swamp. See if I can't find them. You, halt! Geralt of Rivia, correct? You were in White Orchard recently. Near Vizima. Mm-hmm. Charming village, if you don't mind rotting corpses. There'd have been one more if not for you. Lena. She survived, thanks to your potion. Nice to see a Nilfgaardian soldier so concerned about the fate of some simple Nordling. But kind of surprising, too. That night, when the griffin attacked her, she was on her way to meet me, in the woods, near the garrison. Lousy spot for a romantic encounter. If the griffin hadn't gotten her, something else would have. I know. But I could only ever get away between watches. Those woods, they were close. Listen, Lena. She has not fully recovered. I took her with me when I was transferred. Thought she might get better. But no. She says nothing. Recognizes no one. Sleeps most of the day. I warned Tamira. Witcher potions have powerful, usually permanent side effects. Can't do anything to help now. Maybe a mage could. I don't know whether to thank you or curse you for not letting her die with dignity. Trust me, the choice I had to make was harder. Deserters tried to flee on horseback. We're caught here, looks like. Fled into the swamp. something else to know for sure.
his mother. The least I can do is get it to her. But that's it. Anything. I was. I wish to know the truth. Be it sweet, be it painful. I wish to know. Your son is dead. How did it happen? He deserted, was caught, then hanged. Lies! Found him hanging next to others. Notice posted on the tree was clear. I do not believe you. My son was no coward. Believe what you will. Found a letter on him, addressed to you. Mother, this may well be the last time I write. In all my letters I have lied. Forgive me. I am no hero. Take no pleasure in killing Nordlings. This place is a nightmare. I have borne it until now. I can bear it no longer. Not long past, they ordered us to murder prisoners. Do you know what this means? To kill defenseless men. I must flee this place. Darling child. Forever. You have found him for me. Your payment. Take it. Faster. Thank you. 
Whoa there, Roach. That's it, Roach. Show me what you got.
Tub. What's it to you? I'm Skelliger bound. Need to get there. Start swimming. Islanders, the Black Ones, all attack us in those waters. No one sails the route these days. Come on. Clans are ready to deal. Leave you alone if you do. Someone's done it. Gotta have. Not likely. Except maybe that daft bastard Wolverstone from the Atropos. A liar, a thief, and a bugger, that one. He might have parlayed with the sea swine. Hmm. Where can I find him? In a pigsty most times. Others, the golden sturgeon. Ask for Flask. Everyone knows him.
back off or I'll kill you. <laughs> I'm not a fear to die. See, I've landed on Ord Skellig. How you figure that? You're wearing clan on crate colors. Ord Skellig's their island. On the Atropos, were you? Yeah. Thought the captain had a deal with you. With us? Meaning who exactly? Might have arranged something with Lugos, but crack? Nay. Clearly should have, though. Outlander ships aren't welcome in these waters. What about you? What do you seek in Skellige, eh? Agreed to meet a sorceress here. Yennefer of Vengerberg. She's supposed to be on Hord Skellig. There's a witch a care trolda. Croc's guest. Could be the one you're meeting. Seen her? Know what the sorceress looks like? Aye. Where's black and white? If not for her tits, you think she was a beached orca? Fact is, even those who see her for a wench would gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. Yennefer's not all bad, once you get to know her. <laughs> Take your word for it. Know the way to Kertrolda? Expect I'll find it. Head north. Then turn west towards the bay before you come to the bridge. You'll find the Jarl port site today. Your sorceress ought to be there too. Thanks. So long. Humming. Place of power, it's gotta be.
to trouble you, but I really have no choice. What is it? Our ship was wrecked against a rocky shore dune in the last storm. I've lost everything. How am I supposed to help? I haven't even got the coin for the journey home, and with each day's delay, I draw closer to bankruptcy. Mm -hmm. Might have guessed you'd come around to coin. So, need a loan? Or is it just alms you're after? I should pay you back every last copper, I swear it. You need only call on me at my address in Novigrad. Fine, I'll help you. I visit Novigrad often enough. Might stop by, see how business is going. Thank you. You'll find me in the port district. My name's Johan Bonner. See you later then. Our time amongst the living is but the wit. This child. I know, but I want to. This madness. Such a young lass. Erna should be the one going. They shared a bed longer. Silence. It is her decision. See you again. The eulogy. King Bran of Clan Twirsek has embarked on his final voyage. At its end, our glorious ancestors await him. Together they will hunt and raid. They will sit round the fire and praise the deeds of ages past. For now, he lives in our hearts. One day, we too shall stand at his side and face the sea together. That will be a good day.
You knew Bran? Yes. He was well respected. Unlike his wife. Skellige is its clans. In times of war, tradition holds the clans unite under the leadership of their king. We bid Bran farewell. Time to pick his successor who will lead us against the Black Ones. The gates of Caer Troll stand open to all who hail Bran of Clan Twilsach dear. Mead and meat will be plentiful. During the wake, those who believe themselves worthy of the crown will step forth. Come to the wake with me? Gladly. Feasts in Skellige, so predictable. Slobbering drunks, brazen boasting, and the inevitable rows that result. Yeah, nothing like the banquets mages attend. Remember the one on Thanid? You were there. How could I forget? I also remember excruciatingly well what happened after the banquet. Reading my mind again? Mm. What's more, I like what I see. Did you learn anything in Velen? Velen. Awful place. Somehow Ciri wound up at the castle of the local ruler, a baron, self-proclaimed. This was after she was injured. Injured? Was it serious? Don't think so. Must have recovered because this baron sent her on to Novigrad. Think she was looking for you at the time. These witches Ciri came across, she was lucky to escape them. Witches? Creatures more like. Can't say exactly what they are, but they're dangerous. Very. Also ran into an old friend of ours in Velen. Kira. What on earth is Kira Metz doing in that wasteland? Hiding from witch hunters. Listen, she told me an elven mage had been there looking for Ciri. Good. You'll need to tell me more when we have some time. Been to Novigrad. Ciri was there, looking for a way to lift some curse. She's not there anymore. You're certain? Heard it from Dandelion, with no embellishments. Do you know any more about this curse? Not much. Ciri ran into some trouble, never finished what she went there to do. I recovered a phylactery. She was looking for a way to enchant it. I'll look at it later. How about you? What have you learned? Something strange happened on Ard Skellig a time ago. A disaster brought about by a burst of magic. Extraordinary, really. Natural anomaly. Never seen anything like it. My intuition tells me Ciri was its cause. As much as I respect your intuition, Yen, we need something specific. Evidence. I'd know for certain if I was able to inspect the disaster zone. Unfortunately, Ermion and his druids aren't letting anyone near. Ermion's head of the Skellige Circle? Haven't seen him since... Um... Since Ciri was a little girl. I doubt he'll do you any favors, not even for old time's sake. So why won't Ermion let you inspect the area of the anomaly? Call it a difference of opinion. A large, loud difference. Look, it's Krach. Wait, Wolf. Greetings, Krach. I shall see you at the wake, and I'll not accept any excuses. I've an important matter to discuss with you. I shall wear black and white for the feast. I count on you to don something complimentary. Something that doesn't reek of a thousand hunts. Yen, you know I can't stand new doublets. Just too tight till you break them in. And just like Krog, I'll not accept any excuses. We're not here to enjoy ourselves. We've matters to resolve and should dress appropriately. I've rented a room at the inn. Took the liberty of laying out some clothes for you there. You ought to go, choose something. In the meantime, I've something to attend to. We'll meet at the entrance to the feast hall.
Watch it. Listen, Witcher. There are some weird diablin. You know, drowners. Real problem. The kind your silver sword could most certainly solve. Let me guess. They're tearing your nets, devouring your fish, and attacking the occasional lone boatman or tavern patron who walks home along the shore. Were that the only harm? Terrors in the bay are meaner than on the continent. They hunt come dusk or dawn. Attack fishermen wielding just oars and warriors alike. Sea tosses them up after. Armor shredded, guts devoured. Strange. Any witnesses? Rurik, my apprentice. He was on a boat the Muir Diablin attacked. There's Tove, too. Her man was killed. She lives nearby, up a bit. Sorry, none other comes to mind. Those who see the beasts, meet him. Well, they generally don't come back to dry land alive. I'll take the job. Dealt with drowners many times. It'll soon be over. Got my word on that. Don't eat so much. Why this spit not? Because if I get hit in my gut and those hair, you get tangled in your entrails. This has got to be Yen's room. She always did like space and the luxury. Glamour. Scent of lilac and gooseberries, even with the lid on. Taste hasn't changed. Hmm. The stuffed unicorn. She fixed it. No idea how she managed to bring so much clothing. Must have hired out a galleon. As usual, black and white. Her megascope? Guess she never goes anywhere without it. As Philippa Eilhart said, megascopes and toothbrushes, deeply personal possessions. Desire de Vries, the poison source, still turns to it for inspiration. Something I'd ever wear. But what don't we do for our. Hmm. What exactly is she to me? Vagrant. Oh. Last night was. Stick to
grind those swords. But I prefer me trust them. We'll set you free, don't you fret. Let's play some brown shade of a